Okay, this is table P7.40 on page 399. And what we're going to do here is realize that uh, the columns A, B, and C are inputs, and these are outputs. So on a breadboard, these would be switches, and these would be LEDs over here. Now you're going to write an equation for F in the homework. I wanted to show you an example of how this goes by using uh, the column G instead. So let me back up here, let me widen up a bit. So how do you write the logic expression for G in terms of A, B, and C? Well, the way you do this is any of these uh, rows that have a one in them, you write out a logic expression that corresponds to that being one. So in the first case, it would be where A is not on, B is not on, and C is not on. So it's A, not B not C not and then you say it's going to be on for that case or we look at another case down right here it's going to be on uh, if A is not on and B and C are on so there's that one right there and that's the only uh, terms for the uh, function or the output G let me do another one for example the I column over here you can see that it does also have the not A, B, and C. So the output for I is high if this is true, or if A, B, and not C are on, as we see here, or if A, B, and C are all on. So we have one term for every one that we have in the column.